It was an unfortunate coincidence which saw gun toting poachers kill an elephant in Samburu just a day after the Kenya Wildlife Service led the country in celebrating the World Elephant Day in Voi, Taita Taveta County. <laughs> Kenya Wildlife Service Director William Kiprono sounded a warning to poachers to keep off the jumbos or risk life imprisonment. Kenya Wildlife Service is up to the task of protecting our wildlife. We are pursuing the enforcement of uh, the Wildlife Conservation and Management Act 2013, which provides for steeper penalties on offenders. But this warning, it seems, is not dealing the much-needed blow to the marauding thugs slaughtering elephants at will. Is in the soup areas of Agatananyuki. The community there were not even aware. The elephant is believed to have been shot twice by poachers who have taken advantage of a resurgence of poaching activities in northern Kenya where incidents of poaching of both elephants and rhinos are on the rise. Scared villagers who feared reprisals from law enforcement agents were quick to absolve themselves from blame. <laughs> According to residents, elephants are revered as they are believed to be deities. However, the latest incident has dealt a blow to conservation efforts with recent statistics indicating that elephant numbers have been rising steadily to about 35,000, most of which are found in the Savo Conservation Area. Ultimately, we all have a duty to save the last great species and places on Earth. Kiprono also warned those soliciting for funds from donors under the pretext that they were protecting elephants in Kenya. There are a few of us who are not very sincere. There are a few of us who just want to make business out of the unfortunate situation that we have in our country. He said the government remains steadfast in implementing the law targeting poachers to ensure that the elephants are protected from those hell-bent on exterminating the elephant population. Judith Akolo, The Lunchtime News.